Peter with uh, Lev Cassandra. Mm -hmm. It's really good. And uh, and Raphael is... I mean, for now, he's my scariest opponent. Yeah, he feels really strong in this yeah. season. Yeah, completely. The addition of the Auto GI in his preparation stance and the low attack it's just created a terrifying stance. Yeah. Okay, so, so we, we got this match. Yeah, uh, both already at 50 here. Yeah. I tried to get him to wake up. Didn't really work out though. Yeah, Miss GI not finished. And the 3B. Rafael got uh, one of the best 3 in the game actually uh, now that the preparation stance has uh, mid auto GI mm -hmm. uh, I guess he has the best 3 in the game very less very less risks okay uh, nice I mean combo. I would argue Taki's 3v is also pretty ridiculous that's true that's true okay so try activation for Lev nice opening <laughs> Gets even a combo off of it and finishes him off. Yeah, Cassandra's combo is very high when he when she got in Soul Charge or in Diving Force. Like is that new low from Raphael? Oh, the damage of Raphael is so high. Oh, oh no wall splat though. Just yeah. another poke and here we go. And the perfect uh, for Yona Rose. A nice throwback. Yes. What I think is also really strong about Cassandra is she does have the counter hit options, right? She does have some options to profit off of them. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. She uh, likes Sofitia and generally uh, all the character with white pawn and shield. They always have a lot of uh, different defensive options and good offensive options. It's a very well around. <laughs> Interrupt the charge in. Yeah. The... And nice whiff punish. However, left on blinking guard damage here. Yeah, and that's the true weakness of uh, Cassandra. She has to play uh, a little very risky with her guard stamina because she has a mechanic which basically uh, depletes her guard stamina. Okay, nice yes. combo. And full attack, okay. And the new low kick follow up. So Cassandra has the option though in Soul Church to replenish a guard stamina if I'm correct. Uh I don't remember that. Not sure about it. Welcome to the stage of Yeah, very <clears throat> quick match between those two. Yes. Um what I also noticed though is that if you play really defensively against Cassandra, even if, if she depletes her guard stamina, she deals just as much guard damage to you as well. Yeah, 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 that, that's true. So it usually becomes a race uh, to who gets broken first. Yeah, if you exactly. If try to play defensive against her. Yeah, she's basically uh, making the path of the game uh, quicker, like... Yeah. Your, your guard will, will just crush, or her guard will crush. It's caught by the mid. Yeah, nice opening again. Yonaro's putting a hard pressure right now. Couldn't step it. Oh, gets uh, caught by the AB. Unblockable, okay. No punish, it's minus 14. When you block the, uh, the non-unblockable version. Okay, and the reversal edge A. I gotta say, like, um, many people, when they read the reversal edge changes, they thought, like, okay, this this is getting nerfed now, right? But I think reversal edge is stronger than ever before. Oh, really? 
Oh yeah, definitely. Not only do okay. you like because of the guard damage. Yeah, either the guard damage, right? Or um, the meter generation on it is now just absolutely oh, ridiculous, yeah. right? Even yeah, if yeah. you like, you can still connect the attack in a lot of cases. Yeah. Right. Wow. And Cassandra, uh, be careful of the ring out, no ring out mm. on that combo. And nice finish. So they are both even now. Uh, and the guard. And that will be her. Uh, no, no ring oh, out, no wall splat. Yeah, he, he should have had that. I think that was a... Uh, mess up on Iona Rose's part here. Mm. And the soul charge activation for Iona Rose, who really wants to finish that round. And that's it. <laughs> soul charge 1kb. Making the walk. Okay, pressure. Levas, to, he's trying to get the ring out to close that match. Oh, uh, and he will get ring out. 